this is just so tragic. Abby Lee Miller underwent a four-hour-long emergency spinal surgery on April 17 that saved her from nearly dying. Yet what was believed to initially be an infection has now been revealed as cancer. Her doctor gave people the terrifying news and what the next steps will be in treating the former dance mum's star. It was not an infection, it was a type of a non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, it's a type of a cancer, doctor. Humar Nem Melamed, an orthopedic spine surgeon at Cedar sinai Marina Del Rey Hospital who has been treating the star told the publication, We're getting an oncologist involved and we have to figure out what the next steps are as far as chemotherapy or radiation or more spine surgery, depending on the tumor type, depending on the sensitivity of the tumor. It just depends the type but I feel more than yes, she will undergo chemotherapy or radiation, he continued. The former reality star was just released from prison on March 28 after spending eight months behind bars for bankruptcy fraud. Since then she has been living in a halfway house in Long Beach, California. Abby went to the emergency room after suffering excruciating neck pain and was losing feeling in her arm. Her condition worsened over the next few days and the 51-year-old underwent a life-saving emergency surgery on April 17. If we didn't do something, she was going to die, Dr. Melamed previously told people. Her blood pressure was bottoming out. She was not doing well. As for her prognosis, her doctor says there's a chance this can spread to any part of the body, this is probably coming from somewhere else. We don't know where the source is. Any tumor that spreads anywhere is automatically stage 4, but we have not determined the stage yet. Stage 4 is the most deadly type of cancer so hopefully this isn't the case.